Okay. Where do we start? Hmm. Let me know in the comments. What is like one thing that you really struggle getting rid of? Y'all wanna know what I struggle to get rid of? Okay. I don't even know if one bag's gonna work. Welcome back to a new video. Today is going to be a declutter with me, but we're gonna do it together. I'm gonna grab a bag, we're gonna head to my closet, and we're gonna go through some clothes. I have accumulated quite a bit recently due to a transition in size. So at the beginning of the year, I started working out and losing weight. I ended up dropping a couple sizes. I was a size 11 in a size 9, 10 jeans. Well, I would say like 9 to 11, because you know women's jeans are like crazy sizes but I got down to a size 3.5 and also a small top. But I still have a lot of the clothes that did not, that don't fit me anymore from then, and I'm ready to get rid of them. I held on to them for a little bit, thinking, okay, well, let's just hold on to them just in case, you know? Um, but I'm ready to go ahead and let them go. So we're gonna get a bag, we're gonna go through some stuff. I wanna minimalize my wardrobe. I want it to be simplified to where I walk in there and I don't have like, an overwhelming amount of choices to make. I I feel like right now my closet is just slammed to the max. Now, I will say my closet is very, very small. I have hardly any space in our closet, so it feels a lot more full than it actually is at the same time because there's not a whole lot of space in there. Um, if you guys remember, I did a makeover in my closet. I'll link that video below if you wanna check it out. I did two bookcases and then a rods in between to maximize as much storage as I could, to have storage at the top and you know on each side for shoes and things because our closet is like this wide. It's super narrow. Like I even struggle sometimes to get in there, especially if, like right now when it's like overfilled. So yeah, the plan is to go through that together. So grab your bag, grab your snack, get your coffee, and let's go. Okay, so I will have two bags. I have one for clothes I'm gonna give away and then I'm gonna have one for garbage so if there's anything like super stained up or that has holes in it or a lot of paint on it that I'm probably not gonna wear we're gonna go ahead and toss those because I obviously don't want to accidentally add that to the donation um, ugh, pile so got a little bag I don't have a whole lot of clothes that are garbage so I think one Walmart bag will do oh, and my bedroom's a mess so don't judge me I was kind of going through the uh oh uh -huh. yeah see i told you it's bad it's hard to walk in here because of how narrow this closet is but then having an overwhelming stuffed amount of clothes makes it even worse so yeah we're gonna fix this <laughs> oh you know what i'm gonna do here's what i'm gonna do instead i have an empty laundry basket here so just to make it a little bit more like faster instead of having to like throw all of the clothes into the bag. I'm gonna throw them in the laundry basket and then I'll fold them and then put them in the bag. That way it's just nicer um, for those who want to go through them. Let me get this out of here. <gasps> There's my belt. I'm so unorganized. I literally could not find my belt the other day and I was like getting mad because I have this thing right now where jeans like fit me on my legs and my butt, but like my waist, not so much. So, I don't know. But I needed this. So, I'll, I'll put that up here for now. Okay. Where do we start? You know, where do you start when you're doing a project like this? It's, it's, oh. Yeah. Um, and then those bags down there, just real quick, just to give you like a little rundown on the closet situation. Those are my daughter's birthday gifts. So, those are going to stay right there for now. I mean, I'll, once I clean it up, I'll move them. But, Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Where do we start? <sighs> okay. All right, we'll start with these. I don't love those jeans, and I recently got new black jeans, so we'll start with those. Okay. This top is super cute, but it's not my favorite. And every time I wear it, I feel self-conscious in it. It's like a bodysuit with um, these really cute ruffle sleeves. Like I said, it's very cute. It's just, it, it doesn't fit 
my body shape that well. So we're going to go ahead and give that one away. Okay, there's that and that and that. This is my husband, so we're going to move that down here. This is a long sleeve wrap dress. This is, or not dress, top. This is so cute. This is a size extra large in the YMI brand. Um, it's so pretty. I love this top, but it is very large on me. And I can tighten it because like around the bottom it has like this wrap right here. So you can tighten it. But then it's just like it's a lot of extra fabric and I think it's time to just let that go. This is actually a pajama shirt. So we're going to put that right there for now. This is another bodysuit that I don't really care for. So this is a white bodysuit. Um, I actually ordered this one on Amazon. This is why I don't order bodysuits online because of this reason right here. If I can't try it on to know that I like it, I end up not wearing it. It's pretty. It's very nice. Very good quality. It's just, it doesn't fit me right. I feel like I'm already making great progress. This we're going to get rid of. It's just a plain black tank top. I don't really wear it. Okay. Alright, these jeans right here. Okay, so these are... Why is it messed up? All right, I need to try these on. So this is a pair. I'm going to put all my jeans right here because I need to go through them and try them on. All right, this dress. I have tried to wear this particular dress like a hundred times. And yes, I know. Some of my clothes are all inside out. <laughs> okay, so this dress right here. This one I got from Target. I was going to wear it for um, fall last year. Or wait, was it last year? Spring. I was going to wear it for like spring. I think it was for like Easter or something. But, and I love it. It's just, it's one of those dresses that I'm not 100% confident in. So we're going to go ahead and dig into that. This dress I bought to possibly wear to my sister-in-law's wedding because she wanted gray and this was like the only blue gray I could find. So I ended up buying it because I was like getting nervous that I wasn't going to find anything in time. And it's very, very pretty on. It looks like it would be short, but it's not. I'm shorter, so it comes like to my knees. Um, and it was $16.99, still has the tags on it. So we're going to declutter this. We're going to give this to, um, by the way, all these clothes I'm going to give to my cousin's wife and um, their, her daughters because she's got lots of, lots of girls so they can go through all that stuff. Clutter it. Okay. All of these can go. Another dress that I bought that I thought I would love and I don't. It just doesn't fit me well. It's like one of those bodycon Shein dresses that like ruche here on the sides. And I'm just not a huge fan. So we're going to get rid of that. Alright. So a couple more tank tops that I never wear. So this one was one of my favorite um, like silky tops that I bought. But I... So I have like more of like a, it's going to be kind of weird when I describe this. So when I wear like tank tops like this, I feel like it makes my shoulders like a little bit more broad. Once again, this is just my own personal opinion of, you know, my body shape. So I don't love the way that tank tops like this look on me. And something else about these is having kids, I feel like I'm constantly bending over. And this top in particular, when I bend forward, you know, like no. <laughs> I can't, I can't be having all that. So, yeah, we're already making progress. It's almost a whole basket full. So we're going to go ahead and slide this stuff down. And we'll start working down here. I think when I hit the bins up top too, that's whenever you're going to see me get rid of some things. Because I finally found leggings that I love and all the other ones that got to go. Like, this is another green pretty top. Once again, when I bend forward, it shows all of it, so we can't wear that. Okay, those are going to go over there. I need to try those on. All right, here's another. This is the newest pair of jeans that I got, the Sofia Vergara brand. That's the ones I actually have on now, but I have them in the blue denim. I love these. I love the way they fit. 
Um, they are a little loose on my waist, but nothing a belt can't fix. So I got those. These are my favorite shorts. I wear these all the time. These jeans I'm not sure of, so I'm going to go through the jeans in just a moment. That's my... There's that. That. Okay. These are... These are my favorite leggings, so I don't want to get these mixed in with anything else because I've done that before. I've accidentally thrown out, not thrown them out, but, you know, like tossed them. This one has like a deodorant stain on it that I can't get out. Like every time I wash it, it doesn't come out. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just like I don't know how to get the deodorant stains out. So maybe I'll try to rewash it one more time. This is my workout top. I love these. I wear these all the time. Let me know in the comments. What is like one thing that you really struggle getting rid of? Y'all want to know what I struggle to get rid of? <laughs> Tank tops. Like workout tops and leggings. Like I really struggle to get rid of those things. Because I feel like I wear them all the time. So it's hard for me to part with. Okay, so these are really cute I love these these are my shorts that I wear all the time but these are short shorts I actually prefer the ones that are a little longer see how tiny these are and I feel like they kind of cut off at a really bad spot um, I like them they're just a little small for me all right these are trash these I got I ruined and with paint like on accident but they're done I know I'm still pulling clothes out I know it's crazy can't so many gloves. Okay, these shorts are so cute. They are just a little small, so we're gonna go ahead and get rid of those. Okay, these are my good ones. See, these are the ones that I like better. See how lo much longer these are compared to the other black shorts? I mean, I know they look small too, but I wear these and they fit fine. So, got those. Okay, these got something on them, so those got to go. These are my good pants. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back. Take my time, just enjoy the ride. A new man passing by. Life is good, best I've ever felt Get me up, so in it, so where I can find myself Oh, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive As I reach out, reach out, reach out, reach out to the sky In the dark, against it all, but made it through the day. Cause I found my way, I found my way. In bad times, I know I'll be okay. Cause I found my way. Okay, so up here, I keep extra clothes. I also have my taxes in this one. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, this one has like paint clothes and like old t shirts and stuff. So I'm gonna pull this one down. And then this one, <coughs> excuse me, I keep trying. <coughs> oh my gosh. This one has bathing suits, tank tops, all kinds of randomness. So I'm going to go through that one and this one. I wanted to give y'all an update. So this big old basket full is all the stuff that I have decluttered so far. Um, I have a few more things right here on the floor, so I'm actually gonna pull this over here. Ugh. Okay, and then 
throw the stuff that fell out of the basket over there and we're gonna actually fold all that stuff and um, put it in the bag properly so that way it's not just like all thrown in there and I'll show you guys all the stuff that I got rid of I actually had that requested last time I did a massive declutter like this um, some of you were like show us everything that you got rid of and um, I don't know why I've never done that so I'm gonna do that I'm gonna lay everything out so you can see how many like jeans how many shorts and say hello to oh, come here come here Come here, cheer mother. Oh, there was ease. There was ease. Oh, oh, it's the wedge. Oh, it's just a mommy's baby. What are you doing? In? Where have you been? You have a flower on you. You're so pretty. Okay, so I went through the back of the closet back here. It has some like personal things, so I didn't like film all that. But these are things that were back there that don't belong. So I had a belt. I had some of these boxes that we held on to after purchasing our camera system. And then um, my Canon, which I have right now that I'm using. So I'm going to throw all that stuff away because I don't need it. And then this can of paint needs to go out in the shed. That's what I was using to do some, like, touch-ups um, a while back. And I just kind of stuck it in the closet. <laughs> um, so that needs to go out in the shed. And then all this can go in the garbage except for my belt. Okay, so I'm to the try-on portion now. <laughs> oh, and I got lint and dust and everything else all over me. So I'm going to try on some of the shorts that I was a little unsure if I was going to like. I do like these a lot. These are very comfortable. I feel like I would definitely wear these this coming up summer. So I'm going to go ahead and hold on to these um, and move on to the next pair. Okay, so here are a pair of skinny jeans. I actually didn't even think that these fit me. Um, I really love these. I like the wash in the front. I feel like it's super flattering, just dark denim, no distressing. So for now, I'm going to go ahead and hold on to these. I like that they're skinny, so I can wear these with my boots if I want. Um, and they don't look bad on the back. So I'll hold on to these for now. I tried these on for the first time in a long time. And not too long ago, these did not fit me. So they were like way too tight. And now look. Look at, can you see? Look at all that room I got. And here, as well, crazy, because at one point my stomach was like bulging over these. I have a picture I took in these like as a progress picture just to monitor, because these were always my favorite jeans, and then I wasn't able to wear them for so long because they were way too tight, and now they fit so good. I love these. I hate that the knee busted out, though. So I'm probably just going to cut these off into shorts because they fit me well everywhere else, and I've always loved the distressing right here. Uh, <clears throat> so yeah, I'm probably just going to cut these into some shorts and, and rock them this coming up summer. Yay, these fit. Okay, I have another victory to share with you guys. Check out these pants. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. These once fit like so tight to the point where like the button would pop and listen to it. Like, sometimes I would sit down, like, I remember wearing these specifically out to dinner one night, and I sat down, and the button busted, and you could hear it, and I was like, oh my gosh, I hope no one heard that, but crazy, super proud to, like, be able to try these on and see physically just how, what a difference, you know, even though, like, I haven't been as consistent with working out, it still, you know, makes me happy that these are loose, you can, like, see your progress, I always recommend taking progress photos, if you're on, like, a fitness journey, Y'all, take them progress photos because when you go back and look, then you can see just how much you've lost. And it's like, it's very motivating. It really is. It gives me like so much encouragement. Alrighty. I went through the closet and it looks so good. This is like probably the most organized I think it's ever been. I'm so proud. I got rid of so much. So I'm going to give you a little closet tour. Here I have all my denim shorts. I have all my leggings in here and I did declutter these. Um, so it's not even full. I got rid of all the ones I don't wear. These are the ones I love. Um, I have all my bras and underwear in here. And then I have my pajama clothes. Like long t-shirts and like, like comfy shorts. And then here's where I keep my socks. This way I have all my denim jeans hanging up. I was going to keep them folded. But I think it looks a lot more organized with them hanging. So I got those hung up. And then I color coordinated all my clothes. Look at me. <laughs> I never do that. So when I do it, it looks so good. Um, but I did that, and then I did go through this area over here. I'm not going to show you guys too much 
just because I do have some like financial things over there so I just want to make sure that doesn't show up on camera um, but yeah all that I went through and just kind of quickly organized it um, up here I went through my bathing suits so this is like halfway full now and then I have all of our like finance stuff in there and then this one right here is um, gift bags and my daughter's presents are up in there for right now and then the one all the way on the side is book bags, um, luggage, stuff like that I put in there. And then I have just like my one nice purse that I keep. So that is that. Looks great. So then this is all the stuff I'm getting rid of. <gasps> is that crazy? I am. This is so great. This just makes me feel so good. So I'm going to go in there, fold everything, kind of sort it through, like from t-shirt to jeans, shorts, stuff like that. That way everything's nice and organized for them when they go through it. And um, I can give you like a little overview of everything. It's pretty wild when you have it all stacked up like this. All right, so here's everything now that I have it kind of like piled up. So we have all this was garbage. The hangers, those hangers are broken. I have, are you serious right now? Pay attention to me, mom. <laughs> You're so cute. I can't with you. Hi, honey. Um, and these are all the clothes. Every, are y'all serious? Come on, are I gonna go potty? I go outside? All right, let's go. Okay, so here is everything. We have all denim shorts here. Um, these are all jeans. And then I have more denim shorts here and a couple more pairs of jeans. These are all the bathing suits. Like I said, I just kind of piled them up. I'm gonna put them in a separate bag. Um, but then we have a bunch of tank tops, some like lounge around the house wear. Um, we have like bras, undergarments. These are like those, um, what are they called? What is this called? Like under, what are they called whenever they suck y'all in? Um, shapewear. <laughs> That's it. Um, two things of shapewear that I don't really wear. And then just some sports bras that don't really fit me. We got all the nice shirts right here. So these are like dressier clothes. We have dresses, just some nice like blouses. So I kind of stack those separately. Um, but yeah. All right, so I'm gonna start bagging everything up. I'm actually gonna do all the denim in one bag and then all the shirts in another, just to somewhat keep it organized for them um, when they go through it. But I swear, this is like the best thing ever. I love, like anytime my sister-in-law gives me clothes or just anybody gives me anything to go through, it's like so much fun. There is something about getting free clothes and just like going through hand-me-downs that just make me so happy. And I'm so excited for them to go through this stuff because I know like whenever I was younger, and my mom would like bring home a bag of clothes from like a friend or a friend or something. We'd like get so excited sorting through everything and finding new stuff. I swear. It just makes clothes so much more enjoyable when you get them as hand-me-downs. I don't know why, but it just really does. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and 
Put all this in there. just the denim and then I'm gonna get a Walmart bag for that my bathing suits are I deserve that. I deserve that so much for having them this tangled up. We're gonna make it fit. I've held on to some of this stuff for so long like thinking I'm gonna wear it. I might not like it right now, but maybe whenever I get to this weight or this shape, I will like them and I'll wear them and then I don't wear them. So I'm so happy to be getting rid of this stuff. Y'all have no idea. It's like a weight has been lifted off my shoulders. And plus I had, I have purchased quite a few like newer clothes. So it was time to like declutter the stuff that I had. Um, to make room for the new stuff that I purchased that I actually do love. turned on by itself. Sure. <laughs> I'm gonna try to wash that again. Let's see if I can clean that. There's like a white spot on the shoe. But it's fine. done with the closet and it feels so good to have that done it's like a weight is lifted off your shoulder shoulders when you go through your clothes so everything's bagged up here um, and then I have a basket of laundry things that I found on the floor that needed to be rewashed that were just kind of sitting down at the bottom of the closet um, and a pair of shoes I'm gonna try to wash and then also if you're wondering what all this stuff is so this plant is actually the one that goes on the table and then this morning I had to grab a few things I had to get this for my daughter's birthday party. I'm gonna use it for drinks and just pour like ice in there so it's easy for the kids to grab and go. And then I had to get some paint for a project that I have coming up at my little brother's house. So that'll be coming out soon, I'm excited. I'm gonna go over there and work on that tomorrow. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's it for today's video. And it was short and sweet, but I was able to get rid of some stuff. I enjoyed sharing with you guys. I hope you enjoyed watching. And let me know in the comments if you were able to get rid of some stuff too. If you decluttered with me, um, what all did you get rid of? Do you feel lighter? <laughs> um, and I hope y'all have a great day. Bye y'all. We're going to do this together. So grab your bag. <laughs> I was going to say grab your closet, but I guess you can't grab your closet. So make sure you grab a bag, head, head. <laughs> oh, why am I going to start over? <laughs> okay. Take 10. <laughs> 
Seriously though, I've been struggling to film this intro. I cannot get it right. So let's, let's try this one more time. This is it. We're gonna roll with it. Whatever I say is the same. My bathing suits are so I deserve that. I deserve that so much. I don't even know if one bag is gonna work. Oh, that's not weird or anything. The TV just turned on by itself. Sure.